If you haven't started to use vidIQ yet, I would highly recommend at least grabbing the free version. For that, you're going to need to install the Chrome Web Extension from the Chrome Web Extension Store. After installing it, you will be able to see the metrics I'm going to show you next. Head over to vidIQ's website after you log in with your details. In the top menu of the dashboard, click on the Keywords button. After the page has loaded, just type in the keyword that you would like it to analyze. It will give you four scorecards. First, the Keyword Overview card with details on search volume and competition. The score is determined to help you gauge how effective this keyword is. Second, the Related Keywords card shows you the related keywords to your searched keyword or phrase. Then, the Matching Terms card shows you keywords that contain your searched keyword or phrase in any order. And finally, the Questions card. This card actually tells you what questions people are asking when searching for that keyword. Do you realize how priceless this is to have this insight on your viewers? Knowing how to create better content? This is amazing, because these ideas are super useful, especially if you're planning to create content that is targeted to receive significant views from YouTube search. I'll leave you a link in the description where you can sign up for free and using the promo code it will give you 35% off 3 months on one of the paid plans, enabling you to access more advanced tools. And if you want to take your keyword research to the next level, click and watch this video on screen next, where I will show you how to check if certain keywords are still relevant now, and meanwhile if you're interested in finding out what other incredible tools VidIQ has to offer, click this video here where I will show you how you can get more views with VidIQ AI tools and also save time in your video creation process. Now tap that subscribe button below so you will get notified as soon as it comes out. Thanks for watching and I'll be seeing you in the next one.